So here it is. We're going to go ahead and announce the 200 subscriber giveaway. I'm going to open up a couple packs of cards. I actually went through and dug out the packs that were for the 100 subscribers uh, a couple months ago and got everything together because I finally got everybody's addresses, finally got everybody's information. So you should be getting your stuff soon. I'm going to mail it out to you. If I haven't got your information, there are a couple people that are either no longer on YouTube or I'm not able to track them down and I haven't been able to. If, if you happen to be on there, get your, me your information. I'll get your stuff out to you. But I've set aside those packs from those and I decided I would open up a few packs to kind of get in the mood for a 200 subscriber giveaway of some of those products that I'm sending out to people. So I'm going to go ahead and open up four packs of 90 Donruss, four packs of 91 Donruss, and four packs of 90, no, I'll do five packs of 90 tops. I really would like to pull a Frank Thomas no name. So on 200 subscriber giveaway, like this video, leave a comment below and make sure you're subscribed publicly so that I can see your name and put you in the drawing when we do the 200 subscriber giveaway. I'll figure out all those prizes and everything again. I'll step it up a little bit from the last time. I know our top winner got a hanger of, ooh, I don't even know where I just set that. I just had it a second ago, but I think it was of 2022 top series one so we're going to go ahead and get started and i'm going to open up these packs just for a little entertainment so you guys don't have to watch some boring hey here comes the subscriber giveaway video so hang on one second rounded it up found it all right we're going to get started all right so here's a little trick that i learned from the uh last couple times that i've opened packs i'm going to do the 90s tops last because that is going to be hey there's my hand that is going to be full of gum and gum dust and all that so we'll get these Don Russ out of the way first. We'll alternate. Let's put that together like that. I'll leave that right there. Put these up here. All right, that's going to be our first pack of 1991. 1991. 1990 Don Russ. Maybe pull a Griffey or like a Juan Gonzalez reverse negative or something exciting like that. Never know. All right. Got a puzzle piece, Oral Hershiser, Mark Grant, Bill Swift. Now there's a lot of error cards in here that I don't normally go through to see if I get or anything, but occasionally I'll check it. And if I see anything that stands out, they, people always list them on eBay for excessive amounts of money. There's a Marquise Grissom rated rookie, and they're not necessarily worth that amount of money. So far, I'll put that right there. So far, that Grissom is our best card. We've got Pete Harnish, Terry Kennedy, Tom Candiotti, Pete Smith, Mark Gubiza, R.J. Reynolds, who for a split second always fools you like it's a Barry Bonds card, Sid Fernandez, and Brian Smith. A little bit of wax, wax residue on the back. Usually the last card got that. I'm going to set it separate. All right, so we've got 91 Donruss. I believe this is Series 1, because I think the Series 2 is green. The packs are like a lime green or light green. I actually had, when I was a kid one time, I opened up almost a full case of Donruss, of 91 Donruss, until I finally pulled an Elite Series, which was an Elite Series Jose Canseco. So that was pretty exciting. I actually just sold it a few years ago for not very much money, but it was exciting when I was a kid. Kelly Gruber, Brett Butler, Gino Petrelli, Greg Harris, ooh, Craig Vigio. We'll put that BG over there. Dave Stewart, no hitter. Harold Reynolds, always exciting on MLB Network. Lee Smith, Steve Sachs, Bob Walks, Gene Larkin. You guys can all see these. I don't know that I need to say. I'll say if I get anybody good. That way I don't slow it down. And a puzzle piece. That back card did not seem to have any wax on it. Maybe they resolved it a little by 1991. All right, we're back to the 1990. If anybody sees any of those air, you can see the wax is just sticking on here. If anybody happens to see an air and wants to shout it out, they can. All right, another puzzle piece for Yaz. There's a checklist. Mitch Webbs. There's a George Brett. Remember, I'm only saying the good ones. So Jack Morris. That's not too bad. B.J. Serhoff. I think that's his third year. Maybe fourth. There's a Carlton Fisk. And that's it on that one. Oopsie, almost grabbed the 90 tops there. Now these were all from a sealed sealed box. In case you were wondering if anybody was fishing through them or anything. Oh, this one is. 
ones and they're good. I think that's Willie Stargell is the puzzle piece for 91. If I'm not mistaken. Hmm, that's weird. Hmm. Dante Bichette. I'll talk a little bit so I'm not so boring. Hey, there's a Mark McGuire. Francisco Cabrera. A big favorite of us Braves fans. This is one oriented very weirdly. Hmm. I don't know why anybody would be searching 91 Don Russ and then pulling it back together, but that was a weird orientation. I'm always suspicious of old wax. You can see that where it's eaten up on there. It's a Bobby Bow. That got eaten up on the back with some wax. We're waiting on July 1st for his payday. That's Bernie Williams. I think that's second year. No, that's a rookie card. Okay, cool. Um, Danny Tartable. Carlton Fisk again. Steve Sachs. Dave Stewart. Big Cat. Nice. All right. Head it back to the 91. So you can see this one is oriented fine. And you see that's going to be that Willie Stargell. There's a Big Mac. Got a couple of those. Well, a couple. Hey, there's a Nolan Ryan. That's always nice to have. And a Griffey. So far, this has been a good patch right here. Probably the best pack we've had so far. It's just kind of a little teaser for, you know, some old junk wax stuff. I know it's not too exciting to most people, but I have fun with this stuff. And I collected this about as much as I could when I was a kid. That was back when they used to sell packs in convenience stores and things like that for some of the younger generation. <laughs> and you could just pick them up at the 7-Eleven or the Conway Food Mart, as I would usually go to after school. There's that one. And there's another Mark McGuire. If anybody wants a Mark McGuire lot, hey, there we go. That's one of those ones you want to go after. That is a Sammy Sosa. That is his rookie card. Dennis Martinez, there's a Todd Zeal rookie. I don't know that that's worth too much anymore. Back in the day, we were always chasing the Todd Zeal rookie. Back in actual 1990. Um, okay, this is going to be the last pack. That was the last pack of the 1990. And this is the last pack that we're going to open of the 91 Don Russ. Let's see, Jeff Russell, Bip Roberts, Bob Tewksbury. Jamie Navarro, hey, there's a Ryan Sandberg, and a George Brett. And you can see the corners on these after the Brett. I definitely, I don't know if you can see that. I definitely dinged up, so I put it up on too, too good. And our final puzzle piece for that. All right, so I'm going to clear these off for a second. I'll set these wax ones over there because this is about to get old gum dusty. Right, keep those. If anybody wants any of these, we'll, we'll put together a lot for somebody. It'll be a huge, huge eBay sale. All right, so this is going to be our first pack of the 90 tops. Obviously, we are shooting for a Frank Thomas rookie. I can show you the old nasty gum if you would like. There it goes. No, I'm not going to chew it. All right. Todd Bar Oh, it just feels wonderful. Obi McDowell. There's a Hojo. We'll set that over there. George Brett. We are pulling all kinds of George Bretts today. The Sparky Anderson. Frank Robinson. Bill Long. I, I know Bill Long. He's a police officer. Does not look like that. He is a halfway decent air hockey player. That helps. There's another Howard Johnson. And set that. I don't want to get that on the puzzle. Something's falling over here. Got it. Saved it. All right. Sorry. Let me see what that was. It's just one of these. There's some old nasty gum. All right. Andy McGaffigan. McGaffigan, McGaffigan. Uh, Mark Knutson. Jeff Ballard. Hey, there's a Canseco card. I remember when I was a kid, that was one to go after. Not so much anymore. Bobby Thigpen. And two checklists. One of their sequential. 102, oh, 783. No. All right. So we are 
two packs into the 90 tops. And we will see what we got here. Kevin Gross, Tony La Russa, Dave Henderson, Lenny Dykstra, Richard Dodson, Don Jones, Jose Uribe. Pull a couple of Uribe's, or two at least. And Patterson. There we go. There's one of those Nolan Ryan 5,000 strikeout cards. Those are always nice to pull. Let's see what else we got here. Still no Frank Thomas. And usually if you're waiting on a Frank Thomas, you'll get a Kurt Schilling as well. Hey, there's that old nasty gum. And of course it's on Bo. Oh man. I love me some Bo Jackson. Get that dust off of there. Sorry, I'm using my shirt. I don't have a microfiber with me. There's Bo Jackson. Good old Bo. Mike Scott. I have a couple of Mike Scott autographs from what I got when I was a kid. During some Astro games. Chris Sabo. Louis Meadows. I don't think I have any Louis Meadows. David Wells. It's a nice David Wells. I'll put David Wells out in a second. Julio Franco. And another Sammy Sosa. So we pulled a 90 Donruss Sammy Sosa and a 90 Tops Sammy Sosa. It's not too bad. And this is our last one. Oh, nice. We got a Randy Johnson. It's got a little, little bubblegum dust on him. We'll give it the old Kate O'Brien shirt wife off. Randy Johnson. Carlos Martinez. Cito Gaston. And Chip Hale. Interesting. Jim Leland. Danny Jackson. Lance Johnson. Mitch Webster. Roberto Alomar. That's not bad. Neither is Tony Gwynn. And that's going to be it. No Frank Thomas. No nothing like that. But all in all, not too bad. Not a bad opening after all. Had a couple decent cards in there. My favorite was probably the Bo Jackson just because I love pulling Bo Jackson stuff. But the Sosas were nice and a few other things. So we definitely had some decent pulls for a, a lesser product. So I hope you guys enjoyed that. Like I said, like, subscribe, comment if you want to get in the drawing for the 200 subscribers. Make your subscription public or at least somewhere where I can see it. I try to keep track and, and keep a list as you guys subscribe so that I'll have your name in there. Um, I have decided that being a older junk wax pack opener, I end up with a lot of extra gum. So this is going to be the first place prize, a cool whip tub of old nasty gum. Hope you guys are really excited about that. I am totally kidding. I will come up with some nice prizes, but I do have this big giant tub of gum that I have no idea what I'm ever going to do with, and I'm definitely not going to chew it. That's probably about 100 packs worth or more. So again, thank you guys very much, and I hope we make it to 200 soon, and we'll get all your stuff out to you.